So this was the morning of the day we were getting our employment evaluations where I knew it would pretty much be one of my last days. So sure enough, this was after finding out that I have been terminated from my position. Good morning. It is the second day since I got fired or told that I was going to be fired yesterday. It's like 6.15 in the morning and I'm up and I'm about to go into the office. And you're probably wondering, why are you going to the office when you just got fired? Well, I got fired, but my last day is at the end of this month. So they let me work until the end of this month, which is interesting. So I'm still going in. Um, today is the 21st and my last day is pretty much like the 31st, but that's a Sunday. So the 29th would be my last day. Today is Thursday. My last day will be next Friday. So I'm still going in to help out. The transition um, over my task. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm still doing. <laughs> so I just have to kind of present and just show how to do certain things. I'm just going to create a um, checklist of how to do the things that I was doing. So, but I will say I woke up this morning before my alarm clock, which is, I don't think that's really ever happened. <laughs> for as long as I can remember in working here. So I'm kind of waking up with a little pep in my step, low key. Um, I guess it's kind of knowing that soon I won't have to. So it's a little exciting in that sense. Like I'm not gonna miss this two hour commute into the city and back, that's for sure. I'm not gonna miss having to do a whole document project or thousands of documents. On top of all the other work that I have to do, not gonna miss that either. So I guess I have a little pep in my stuff because I feel like I'm soon gonna be free. <laughs> I'm actually pretty content. I kind of seen it coming. Um, so yeah, about to go in. Sorry, in this moment, I was actually grasping the fact that I'm still here after being fired. <laughs> I do enjoy are these walks to take a break from the office and just take in a little outdoor scenery. So it is technically day three of being fired, but still working at the job that I was fired from. Uh, I was basically fired on Wednesday, March 20th. Pretty much it was like at 10.30 a.m. So I thought it was going to be to the end of the day, but then she said to the end of the month. And I'm like, the month? Okay. Like in a way, I was kind of like, that's different. Usually when people are fired it's immediately so when she said to the end of the month i was like okay i didn't even like think much about it i could have said oh, can we just make it effective as a today like honestly today's friday so i work wednesday yesterday now today's the third day friday of being fired but still working what's the point just to be fired anyway i don't know <laughs> uh. you guys so i can't say too much obviously because it's like confidential and everything but i just got off the morning meeting and there's going to be structural changes like <clears throat> completely getting rid of a an entire 
um, department, basically, to outsource it. Since there has been such a decline financially, we've had to let a lot of people go. And there's more to come. It kind of worked out in a way, maybe. I don't know. It is in the IT space. All the news that keeps coming, it's like showing that things are not going that great. And there's just more and more cutbacks, more and more not having budget. So I guess it's kind of like the silver lightning low key because now I don't have to do. And I wipe my hands of it because I have been terminated. So I don't got to worry about all that. All right, it's finally lunch break. I'm going on lunch late. It's like 1.40. I usually go on lunch at 1. So um, I get an hour lunch. <sighs> so I'm coming back at 2.40. They're probably going to be like, oh, where is she? But I'm terminated. So like. Yeah, I'm not going to, I'm going to come back after my hour lunch. I get an hour lunch. You'll see me at 2.40, taking the full hour, okay? I'll just lay down, just watch some YouTube videos. I don't know. But at least it's Friday and it is the weekend, almost. Um, I do have three terminations that I have to do today that I scheduled, which is like annoying. It's like the terminated, terming these people, like... <laughs> Uh, but anyways, I'm still trying to like perform as normal. Still have to make the checklist for the crossover things. I have to do that today. That's going to be what I do the second half of this day after I take this break. Whatever, right? Okay. Uh, well, at least the, the silver lining is um, we get to get ramen. We're going out for ramen. My boyfriend's taking me out for ramen tonight. That's the only thing I'm looking forward to. That's kind of like the reward for getting through this day of work. It's ramen. <laughs> Y'all, it is 5.30. What am I still doing? I technically don't even work here anymore. Okay. I'm about to close it out. My day's supposed to end at 5. So, I'm doing too much to already have pretty much been fired. Okay? <sighs> Let me just close this out. And call it a day. I call it a weekend. Period. We made it to the weekend. We got one more week left before finito okay yeah they gave us extra extra <laughs> three days later so i'm back home after my last day of this job. But yeah, um, I was able to say my goodbyes. And they let me know that if they fiber me anything or any advice or whatnot, that um, I can always reach out. So I thought that was really nice. They did extend that um, gratitude. Um, so it was nice and I was able to say my goodbyes and everything like that so yeah it's just the end of the road I guess for that and just figuring out um, maybe something that will be more along the lines um, for me and my personality and just working on um, different aspects that can help in the future you know so yeah I'm just so hungry right now and just thinking about <laughs> applying for unemployment 
Um, I'm just continuing to apply for job opportunities. This is a YouTube channel that I follow and they always post pretty much every day, multiple times a day of different remote work jobs. Um, you know, mostly things that are a little bit more just straightforward. You know, this job was a lot. <laughs> it was a lot of moving pieces um, and wore a lot of hats and yeah, so maybe something that's a little just more straightforward, a little bit more just direct and I just have to like focus on this sector of thing and just specialize in that one thing. I think it's maybe something that will probably work a little better for me. But yeah, definitely gave me a lot of experience. I learned a lot and um, along the way still. So um, I'll probably talk about that in another video, what I gained from it and what I still need to work on. Um, but yeah, yeah, that was, that was, <laughs> that was crazy. So today's Wednesday. Um, I was already there, so just left my laptop and my ID card. Um, yeah, it's just, this will just be like kind of like the start of a new journey and maybe that's, maybe that's what I needed, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, now I gotta find something to eat. I'm hungry, but anyways, you guys. That's kind of like the end of this road. Thank you guys for watching this vlog and I'll go more into depth in, in another video as to <laughs> why I got fired pretty much and what things I could work on and um, what I might be looking for in my next opportunity. Yeah, so I'll see you guys in that video. And thanks for watching. Bye.